It is said that when superheroes are in danger, they will fire a grappling hook gun at the wall and thus easily climb up and escape. But does this kind of grappling hook gun work in the real world? A duo will verify this. They plan to split up. Jamie is responsible for building a climbing winch, and Adam is in charge of making a gun that can shoot the grappling hook cable into the wall. The most important thing is that the two props must be lightweight, otherwise they can't be hung on the superhero's belt. So Jamie found the smallest and fastest existing motor. But the power of the motor alone wasn't enough to pull him up a tall building. So Jamie installed a gear reducer, which could reduce the rotational speed and increase the torque. Then they conducted a test in the workshop. Obviously, the first superhero prop was completed. On the other side, Adam wasn't idle either. His plan was to connect the grappling hook cable to a nail gun and then use a diver spear gun to shoot it. When a nail gun hit the wall, the blank cartridge would drive the nail into the concrete and pull out the grappling hook cable at the same time. After everything was ready, the two of them took the grappling hook to an abandoned Air Force base. Could they soar into the sky? First up was superhero Jamie. The production team prepared a safety rope for them. This rope wouldn't apply any pulling force. It was just a precaution against the danger in case the grappling hook cable broke. Jamie started climbing up. He successfully reached the 10-meter high roof within 20 seconds. But this climbing device didn't have a reverse gear. How was Jamie going to get down? At this time, he had no choice but to cut the rope. As a result, Jamie's nose was hit by the machine. Next, it was superhero Adam's turn. Although, this launching prop was a bit not up to the requirements. Adam imagined that he was climbing the roof and then aimed at the lair where the bad guys were hiding and fired. But it failed. The nail gun started successfully when it hit the wall, but for some reason, the nail couldn't be driven into the concrete. After reloading, Adam fired the nail gun again. This time, the nail was successfully driven into the wall. But when Adam was about to slide down, the nail fell off. Apparently, the steel cable couldn't support his weight. So, the superhero's grappling hook gun isn't that simple. The rumor has been debunked. 